It is a women's bantamweight matchup between Amanda Nunes and Ronda Rousey. And here is tonight's tale of the tape. Well, at least on paper, what an even matchup here. Everything between these two fighters is nearly identical coming in here tonight. Here once more, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC has around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC Bantamweight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a judo fighter, holding a professional record of 12 wins, no losses. She stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Venice Beach, California, presenting the former UFC Women's Bantamweight Champion of the World, Rowdy Ronda Rousey! And now we're producing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a mixed martial artist, holding the professional record of 17 wins, four losses. She stands five feet eight inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Miami, Florida, Amanda the Lioness Nunes. Okay, could take yourself at all time, will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap Are yourselves you in, because it's about Ready? to go down Fight. right now. Here we go. So here's Amanda Nunes back in defense of her UFC Women's Bantamweight Championship. This is a fighter with every skill in the book. She can be reactionary, she can lead the dance. Let's see how Amanda Nunes approaches the early portions of this one. They clinch up once more. All right, first round is underway. Let's see how long it takes her to find her range with those vaunted, powerful overhand punches. Obviously, it's a big part of her repertoire, and more often than not in the UFC, even when opponents have known it has been coming, they have been unable to stop it. Back to half guard. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly so staying busy. Attempt for her now. It looks like she's got that arm bar locked in tight. Oh, we're getting a finish here. That was a deep arm bar, but a beautiful escape. Rousey gets back up here. Oh, and down. Executed sweep. Full mount. Hip escape. Nice hip escape. She's now back in full mount. Oh, she tagged her with a right hand there. Perfectly timed sweep. Now she gets her back. Set up the arm bar now. She's got that arm bar locked up. It's very close here. This is it. This is it. Outstanding. And it. Outstanding. Beautiful technique setting it up and a beautiful job in getting that submission.
Yeah, no doubt about it. That is some opportunistic grappling right there. And nice finishing instincts as well. You see a lot of fighters get the dominant position, but aren't necessarily able to lock up the choke or force the tap. No problem with her as she gets one of the bigger wins of her UFC career. And here it is again, absolutely perfectly executed. And here we see it again, beautiful submission victory. So there she is, your winner by submission, and there will be no wiping the smile off her face tonight as she turns in one of the bigger highlights of her UFC career. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 31 seconds of the very first round. For the winner by submission, Rowdy Ronda Rousey! All right, so another seminal moment in a career full of them for Ronda Rousey here tonight. She continues the celebration there with her corner, and why not enjoy it? Certainly returning to dominant form here tonight. And I think you can say now she's only getting better at this stage of her career. That is a scary proposition for the rest of this bantamweight division.